Hello my lovers, happy to see you here, welcome back to my channel Hi in Mathematics. Today we have really interesting like relaxing challenge and doesn't matter, you're a kid, you're a student, you're a teacher. Let's solve this challenge together, let's exchange our answers into the comment section, let's write, let's pull the video and write your answer down into the comment section, because this is a very great question for everyone, doesn't matter, you like math, you don't like math, this is really great challenge for everyone to test our school knowledge, to test our algebra skills. So let's do this right now, we can also pull the video and write your assumption down into the comment section, write our answer, let's do this this right now. There are a lot of approaches, how can you solve this challenge, but I'm going to show you this one. This is a really great approach to remember, to learn about power rules. First of all, this 30 can be written as 10 times 3. Let's do this right now. So this 30 can be written as 10 times 3. So 10 times 3. But in the same way, we have third power. So don't forget about this. And we are, we are talking about 40. So let's write this 40 as 10 times 4. Yeah, we have right here 10 times 4. And we raise all of the thing by third power. Really great. So plus. 5 times 10 or 10 times 5, let's do the, th the thing right here, so we have 10 times 5 to the third power. Really great, so this is our first step. Right now, we're going to apply this really interesting, really interesting power rule, this rule looks like that. So if we have a product inside parentheses, we need to raise both elements to this power x. So as a result, we have a to the power x times b to the power x, yeah, times b to the power x. So let's apply this rule in each of these, in each of these step right here. We can easily apply it right here. We can easily apply it, apply it right here. Let's do this right now. As a result, we have 10 to the power 3 times 3 to the power 3 plus 10 to the power 3 times 4 to the power 3 and plus 10 to the power 3 times 5 to the power 3 equal to really great. So I hope you understand this step. Right now, 10 cube, we can easily factor from all of these all these expressions. We can easily do this because we have absolutely the same expression in each of these in each of these parts. Right here, right here, and right here. Okay, so as a result, we have 10 cube, 10 cube, we have right here 3 cube, plus 4 cube, and plus 5 cube. Really great. Right now the final step because 10 cube equal to 1000. But uh, let's do this in the end of the of the simplifying. We have right here 10 cube. But in, in this parenthesis we can easily add all of these expressions because we have 3 cube. We have 27. 4 cube we have 64. And plus 125. This is our 5 cube. 125. Really great. So this is equal to... Right now the final step, very basic step right here, we have 10 cube. This is our 10 times 10 times 10, this is our, our 1000 right here, but we don't need it to find it, uh, in a, to write it as a 1000, let's leave it like that, 10 cube. And 27 plus 64 plus 125 equal to 216, I guess, yeah, we have right here 200, 216, so this is equal to... Because this 216 is really great moment to express as 6 cube, so as a result we have 10 cube times 216 is equal to 6 cube. And right here we have a reverse property because we have right here the a, a to the power x times b to the power x. And right now we're going to write it as a product inside inside one parenthesis. Okay, so we can easily write it as 10 times 6 to the power 3, which is equal to 10 times 6. We have 60, 60, 60 cube, yeah, and this is our answer to this challenge. Of course, we can write it completely with these zeros right here. We can write it as uh, looks like um, 216,000, looks like that. We have 6 times 6 times 6 equal to 216. We can write it also with zeros. We can write it uh, with a completely, completely answer, but I leave it like that with the power. So it's up to you. What do you need? You need it as a power, you need to you need to write it in a whole expression with zero, so it depends on yourself. It's up, up to you how you like. This is a very like easy challenge, but I'm going to show I'm going to share this challenge because maybe a lot of students, a lot of kids watching my channel and wanted to learn power rules. So this is a really great, like a relaxing challenge in the same way, because only in one, two, three, four, five lines right here, we can also solve this challenge more quicklier. Yeah, it depends on yourself, it depends on your algebra skills right here, yeah. This is also a really great moment to, to check, to test our algebra skills, I guess. This is a really great, really great question for everyone. So I hope your answer is the same as mine. But definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. You can easily pause the video, you can easily watch the video once more if you need to, to learn, if you need to um, understand my explanation. But I hope 99% will solve this challenge absolutely correctly because... And this is not like a hard challenge, I guess. Yeah, but maybe one person solved the challenge wrong. I I think that I give 100% that you solved the challenge absolutely correct in another in another step. Okay, so thank you for your time. Have a great day. Let's write our final answer right here. So we have 60 
60 cube. As you can see right here, 30, 40, 50, 60, and right here we have cube, cube, cube. This looks like a really great moment to remember this, this line. 30, 40, 50, 60, and we have right here all the time cube. This looks like really great, really great thing in terms of math. So thank you for your time, have a great day. Definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. You can also write your thoughts down into the comment section, write your response about this challenge. Maybe you have your another approach. It will be really interesting to read about it because this is really great to exchange information down into the comment section. This is also really great, really great moment. So thank you for your time, have a great day, see you in the next videos, take care and love mess, everything will be okay. See you in the next videos.